Welcome to Python for Introductory Statistics. Uh, in this video, you will learn how to use uh, the NumPy library uh, to do scientific calculations uh, in Python. Now let's open, um, we'll go to google.com. If you already have it, you can go ahead and open it. But if not, you could uh, go to google.com and search for CoLab. All right, so let's open here one. So let's say you wanted to find what's the absolute value of negative 100. Um, now, in order to use absolute value and uh, like pi, e, a lot of other scientific notations, we will need to import a library in Python called NumPy. So we'll do import NumPy. And usually, instead of writing the word NumPy again and again, as it's suggested here, we will import it as NP, it's an alias. We're just saving time and space. So instead of uh, typing NUMPY, we'll just type NP. Now, NumPy is a library in Python, a very powerful library for doing scientific computations. So for example, if we wanted to do an absolute value of negative 100, we would do now in the second line, right? So we'll write, NumPy or just MP because we have chosen MP dot we need a period. If you want an absolute value, we'll write absolute and then open parenthesis now negative 100. So the absolute value of negative 100 can be done uh, this way. Another reason that we might need a NumPy is uh, when we do, let's say, the area of a circle. The area of a circle is pi times r squared. For example, if the radius of a circle is, let's say, two miles, then what's the area enclosed in that circle? Well, the formula is pi times r squared. And then in order to get the scientific number pi, which usually is rounded to 3.14, but it has uh, more decimals, we can use a NumPy as well. So we can import it again because we just imported it. It will remember it, but we can do it again by saying again here, import numpy as mp actually this time we'll just import numpy and now we can call numpy dot pi so the letter pi stands for pi in numpy now this will just give us the, the number pi and we can print this so for example if we run this um, here we execute this code it will just it's you know as usual it's 3.14 but they're more decimal so let's say we wanted to find the area now with uh, radius 2. So it will be pi times r squared. So our pi will be numpy that pi times, which is the asterisk, uh, shift 8 in Windows uh, keyboard, and then 2 squared. r is 2 miles, and then when we square it, we do uh, 2 asterisks, and then actually 2 squared would have been 4, but this is why we would want it to use uh, the NumPy library. It's very common, very useful in mathematics and statistics and in all these STEM uh, field areas. And that's how we would import and use NumPy to do some mathematical computations.